When you have a dream, that dream will always be tested. Life is going to see how bad you really want it. It's going to throw so many problems in your path. You're going to lose friends. You're going to lose loved ones. You're going to face disappointment constantly. You're going to feel lost and won't know what to do or where to go. This is where you discover what you are really made of. Are you going to crumble under the weight or are you going to rise stronger and more determined than ever? It's in these moments of uncertainty and pain that your true character is forged. If you really want it, like you say you want it, you will find a way. You'll stop at nothing to reach it because that's what winners do. They don't sit around and feel sorry for themselves. They get their ass up and move forward. They don't allow the pain to stop them. They use it as fuel to go harder. Winners understand that the path to getting to their dreams is not supposed to be easy. Every challenge, every setback is an opportunity to learn, grow, and become even more unstoppable. And that's exactly why those roadblocks and issues are there in the first place. They're there to push whatever that dream is that's on the inside of you out. So you don't stop when you're tired, you stop when you're done, when you've executed. Those days, you don't want to get up and get to work? You got to think about the people you're doing this for. When that alarm goes off and the last thing you want to do is get up, you remind yourself, I'm doing this for my wife. I'm doing this for my husband. I'm doing this for my kids, for my family, and for myself, for my own well-being, for making myself a better person, to become more, to do more, to have more. And when you can think about those things, you can go one more mile, you can go one more hour, you can go one more day at work, you can push yourself to do more than you thought you could. Because your skill will only take you so far, your average instincts will only get you to a certain point. But when you have mental toughness, when you become gritty, when you build your willpower, when you develop that ability to go through really hard sh when you really don't want to do it, when everything sucks when it's miserable, but you can force your mind and body to get the job done. That's when you will reach greatness and make it happen. In life, we all hit points where we've got to choose between giving up or going all in. It's at these moments we got to remember, we're not defined by how many times we've been knocked down, but by how many times we stand the fuck up. This whole thing is about realizing you got this wild potential inside you. And all the tough stuff you gotta do is just the key to letting it loose. Picture yourself staring at a huge mountain. It represents every single doubt, fear, and challenge you've ever faced. But inside you, there's this fire, this unstoppable force saying, I got this. This will not stop me. Think about it. Every monumental thing that's ever been done was once thought impossible. The world's full of stories of people who said, F it, and went for their dreams, who stared down the storm and came out on top. You're no different. You got endless potential and strength like no one's business. And when you dream your dream, I want you to know there are thousands of other people who want exactly the same dream. You're not the only one who wants to be number one. You're not the only one who wants to go to the NBA. So what do you have to do? You gotta outwork, outgrind, and outperform every last one of them. You gotta eat it, you gotta breathe it, you gotta sleep it. Every single thing you do in your life has to pour into that dream. You dedicate yourself to that thing you want and you block out everything else. You don't allow yourself to get pulled off course. If it doesn't support the direction you want to head, you tell it no. You have to make these sacrifices. You have to give up stuff in order to go up. Every single person you look up to, they had the strength to go through all the crap and mud in life to get to the highest peaks because they were willing to push through all the judgment of others and the pain of failing over and over and the tears when everything was going wrong and because they fought through all of that they get to enjoy all of the money all of the support all of the love all of the success that i know you want to reach and 
if you want to get to that level, you got to become relentless and not allow any of the painful things turn you around. It's in these trenches that legends are made, where you mold yourself into the titan you're meant to be. You don't just survive the storm. You learn to dance in the fucking rain, to take those hits and keep moving forward, to get rejected over and over and keep moving forward. Driven by the raw, unyielding desire to see your dream realized, doing whatever it takes, paying whatever price, you keep grinding and keep fighting because you know on the other side of this hell is the life you've been f***ing fighting for. If I can take it, I can make it. If you can take it, you can make it. If you can just keep believing when nothing in you is working, when all your external forces have given way, if you can just manage to somehow keep hoping, you have a chance. You just can't become hopeless. If you can just keep hope alive, you can make it. Because if you keep hoping, it is really faith. You just gotta transpose it into I hope this happened to I believe this can happen. Life is like a grindstone. It can polish you or it can pulverize you, depending on how you position yourself. There's one side of pain that's the suffering and the discomfort side of pain. But then there's another side of pain that's called effort. It's called glory. It's called if you can find a way to push through pain, there's something greater on the other side of it. Every time you find yourself saying that you can't do something, putting yourself down, being negative about you and the possibilities for you, you've got to literally catch yourself. And you've got to affirm to yourself, hey, hey, no, 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 I can make it. There's some way this can happen for me. You've got to remind yourself that you've got powers within you, talents within you that you haven't even reached for yet. That once you give yourself an opportunity to try and to experiment with your life, to stretch, you'll find out you can do more than you can ever begin to imagine. You've got to say yes, yes to my dreams, yes to me, yes I can. Doesn't matter how many failures I've made, doesn't matter how many mistakes I've endured, doesn't matter about what I've done, I can make it. I don't know one motherfucker that is successful that doesn't take inventory of every fucking comment that anybody has ever made to them. Every time somebody doubts them, they get fucking pissed. And when they get pissed, they go out and do productive things. They don't dwell. They don't sit at home crying their beer. They go to the gym. They get their business plan together. They do whatever the fuck it takes to smash people in the fucking mouth with their progress. Build the kind of life that says I told you so without having to say a fucking word. It's about taking what people say you can't do and shoving it down their mother fucking throat. A hundred of fucking nothing. That's how I operate. And that's how you should be thinking about it too. Effort is isolated. Nobody can dictate. Effort is 100% in the mind. Don't give in. Don't be like everybody else. Don't give up. Don't settle because things are hard. Don't let people talk you into their life. Become stronger. Become better. Become faster. Become smarter. Become more productive. When life staggers you the thing that'll get you up on your knees and keep on fighting is it's possible if i just stand long enough i can pull this off i can do it i'm putting it out here i'm not gonna rest until i have it it's necessary i'm gonna do it because whatever you have to do it's worth it because it's your life's purpose and once you know that it is done